Hey guys, hope everyone's having a great day. As you can see here, we got another Jumbo box of 2023 Top Series 1. Um, kind of works out for me that Jumbo's the best format at this point, because I'm a big Jumbo guy. You guys have seen a lot of Jumbos over the last few years. Uh, unless you're new, then go ahead and check out all my other Jumbo videos. I'm usually pretty lucky on these, so we're going to try to keep that going. My first two boxes were, were pretty good. Nothing huge, but uh, not bad by any means. These are super fun. Lots of, uh, you know, that was a terrible cut. Big chance of a lot of stuff in here. Good autos in this checklist. Good rookies. These were actually from Tops. I got these today from FedEx. I ordered them from uh, the site when they put them up and they sold out pretty quickly. I was lucky enough to grab a couple. So uh, that's where these came from. That's why I got them early. Usually my, my boxes come UPS and that comes at like, I don't know, 9 p.m. So lucky enough to get these today. Uh, we're gonna check these silver packs out at the end, but I'm gonna start with our regular packs here. These are, uh, I don't know if the packs are taller or what happened, but these are usually easier to stick in the box like this, but kind of gets stuck on some packs halfway down. There we go, kind of forced that one. I don't know, I like looking at them like the display they're supposed to be, but uh, without further ado, let's break into this. I'm gonna go through this not try to save anything for the end i don't think unless we find something really crazy out of here that we catch um, but uh i feel like at this point we've seen most of the base so i'm probably going to just skip through it make this uh, a decent length video here um, we've seen all the rookies we're going to get every card in the checklist in each jumbo box so not worried about that Gonna try to get to the good stuff. Should have a, a, maybe a backwards card or two here. It's a Kate Cavalli covering up what looks like a rainbow foil. In my other boxes, everything was turned around. It looks like we got a rainbow foil and a gold that are facing forward. So I'm going to try not to miss anything, but it doesn't look like everything's going to be flipped around like my other boxes were, which is fine. I just got to make sure I keep an eye out. If you guys see me miss anything, please let me know. Starting off with 100 green for our first 88 insert. Stick it up. Here we got an all aces of Steven Strasburg. Not a, I don't think it's a parallel. It'll be blue or black or some other color on the back besides purple. Uh, we're gonna go with our foil first, actually. Let's see what we got here. Looks like Byron Buxton on the twins. That Cade Cavalli, just making sure that wasn't a gold SSP or anything. Um, let's see. So the white's on the bottom. So we're gonna flip this to see what our gold is. Ooh, okay, Brian Hayes. It's gonna be a third year card. There's our rainbow foils, our Cabrian Hayes, their first numbered card to 2023. A little tough to see there, but take it. We'll go ahead and get him up on a stand as our first good card. Now, I hope they do a little bit more with the uh, All Aces. So they could do a really, really nice run through multiple products, multiple years, just getting different, different playing card designs and different... Um, I don't know what to call it, like the, the face cards and the number cards and all that to form some kind of deck. That would make those really, really collectible, especially the parallel versions. Um, that's just kind of my thought about it. I'm sure other people have thought the same thing. There's an Adley right on the front of that stack of base. Looks like we have some kind of maybe an orange ice out of here. That'd be a really cool color match to get one of the Orioles rookies. Keep going here. Nothing backwards. Got a gold foil. It's going to be our first. We'll go from the back. I think that's what we're going to do for most of these. 88 weight bogs. Uh, got one of these. These remind me a lot of the, some kind of like lineage insert or something in either 2010 or 2011 tops. It looks really, really familiar. But um, this is the one-two punch of Robbie Ray and Luis Castillo. I think we'll start with this gold foil here. It's upside down. Oh, is that a Nolan Gorman? Nice. Nolan Gorman rainbow foil. We'll take that. I actually sold a pretty big Nolan Gorman card recently. I pulled out of one of my other jumbo boxes. Um, hit an, I'll, I'll go ahead and tell you, I hit an Independence Day to 76. That was really, really cool. Really nice looking card, but went ahead and sold that. So to get a, a nice rainbow foil back is awesome. We'll take that for sure. Get that sleeved up right after we check out this orange. Looks like it's got red borders, so not going to be an Oriole. It's going to be uh, Eric Fetty. For the Nationals. Definitely a big hit of that pack. Nolan Gordon will take that. Got a nice little foil collection going now from Series 1. I'm going to get some of these graded. Hopefully if they drop some prices. Decided to sleeve that one up just to 
add a little bit more protection. We'll get the Fetty Sleeve at low numbered card, but not the most valuable. I can show the numbering on that. That's two, 299. It's 42 of 299. Pretty sweet. Might have to move the jumbo box here in a bit to make some more room. Got plenty of stands here. By plenty, I mean, I don't know, nine, ten. No hits yet, but probably going to find some soon. Don't see any out of here. Uh, we got some stuff here in the middle, though. Looks like a gold. Or oh, this is our auto right here. Okay. So we'll uh, we'll get the auto out of the way early. Why not? Told you I wasn't going to skip much. Looks like it's one of the baseball stars. Possibly a black. Maybe just a base. Hard to tell. But it looks like we also have a gold in this pack. So down here to a Scott Barlow. We got a rainbow foil to start us off. Actually, no. I'll go from the back. Uh, nice Wonder Franco 88. I don't think I hit that in my other boxes. I'll take that. Behind that, or in front of that, Anthony Rizzo, greatest hits. I haven't hit any of the rookies of those uh, inserts. I want to hit one of the Adleys or the Gunners or whoever else is in that. For our Rainbow Foil, it's going to be a Trent Grisham. And we do have a gold, and then our auto. So our gold, I like the colors. Oh, Gunner Henderson gold. Let's go. That's what we're looking for. Nice. So two really nice uh, rookie parallels already in the first three packs. And our auto's coming up after this. I think it goes this way. It's a Yankee rookie. Oswald Peraza. Man, what a pack there. Awesome. Man, what a start to this box. So I believe this is just a base baseball stars auto. Yeah, not numbered, but... Uh, Will not complain about the name. I'll take a base if we're getting Oswald Peraza. Definitely one of the... Let me go and move this guy out of the way. One of the nicer rookie autos you can get. And then, of course, one of the uh, Orioles everyone's looking for. Number one prospect in baseball, Gunnar Henderson. Sharp-looking gold rookie card. Maybe a little bit of white on the top left, but potential right there. Potential. Let me, uh, let me move that over here. It's going to be tough to fit everything. I don't have a super deep stage, so i got to get creative. Man, what a start here. Awesome. Looks like we got a manufactured relic coming out of here. It's very thick. Let's see if we can get one of those nice City Connect patches. I've hit a, I hit a Pio Alonso in one of my boxes, so i got a that for the PC already. I was pretty excited about that one. Can take some of these off. We have another goal. Is that three gold? It's not, oh no, that's our, uh, that's our relic is a gold. Nice. So this should be numbered to 75, I think. Unless that's just the color of the card, but it looks like a gold parallel. Um, George Brett, 88. We have our greatest hits. Pujols, nice. That's for the collection. I haven't seen that one yet. I didn't know he was on the checklist. I'll put that one aside. Um, got a rainbow foil before our hit. It's going to be another rookie. It's going to be Ezekiel Duran. So not too bad there. And then our manufactured relic is this way. Blue Bob, right? Yeah. So that's the little throwback commemorative team patch. I don't know what this one's called. Oh, Patrick of the Past. That's right. And so that is a gold number to 75. Pretty cool card there. I like that little medallion logo. I don't think they were trying to do too much on these, but they do look nice. Let me put that there so you can still see the Gorman. And I'll get that Ezekiel Duran up there. It's not too bad. Maybe I'll just put it on the on the desk in front. Get these other inserts off to the side. Yeah, we'll stick him down there so he's in view. And we'll keep going. So, man, I'm already super happy with this box. I mean, everything else is just kind of bonus at this point. Maybe we'll still hit a nice low-numbered card here since our, our hits, our nice rookie parallels weren't actually super low-numbered. Uh, so there's a Danny Vogelbach on the mats. Love having him on the team. Go look at a gold foil in here. Another Matt, Max Scherzer. Love it. 88, Carlos Correa. Almost a Matt. 30-30 <laughs> of Barry Larkin. And then we do have a nice blue on the back here. So we've got a... That's just a rainbow foil and then a blue. Or it's a gold foil, sorry. It's really hard to tell. Maybe it is a rainbow foil. I can't tell. <laughs> um, it's going to be another Met, Starling Marte. Nice. So that's a, that's got to be a gold foil. Okay. Really light on that one, gold foil. But uh, I think this is going to be a 1988 blue parallel. These are stated print run of 600. I'm pretty sure it's these ones. 
for the Twins. Is it Correa? No, it's Buxton. Nice. Better than Correa for me. Just not salty, but definitely left a bad taste for a Mets fan. That whole situation. But pretty cool. Limited. Let me uh, just take the auto in front. Get Buxton in the back for now. Man, there's such good stuff coming out of these jumbos, guys. I've got one more from Tops coming after this. I, I got, like I said, I got two in this shipment, and then I, uh, my birthday's coming up here in a bit, so I went a little bit crazy, and you guys will definitely be seeing some more Series One from me. So, look out for that. We got Gunnar Henderson leading off that stack of base. Looks like we got another gold parallel coming out of this pack and a gold foil. So we'll go from the back with our 88 Buxton. Got a 40-40 club of Ray Rod. That's a crazy stat. And our gold foil to start. It's going to be Matt Chapman. And our gold parallel here. It's a twin Max Kepler. Everyone's favorite twin. Probably not actually everyone's favorite twin. He, he's filler in a lot of products. His autographs. And I... Uh, to be honest, have not seen much of him in action. I don't watch many Twins games. But he's in the set, and he got a gold, so that's all we can say. I didn't check the numbering on that. That's 11-15 of 2023. Always fun to check that, see if you got a cool number. So we're still looking for a game-used relic coming out of here, and uh, again, hopefully some, some nice numbered stuff, because we've got a home run challenge out of here. Home run challenge cards look pretty nice. I've hit some good names, some guys I should be able to convert on, you know, Jordan Alvarez and names like that. A nice Pujols base to start this pack off, or to, I guess, end it, really. Um, so we'll go from the back with Julio Urias on the 88. Our all aces is going to be Sonny Gray, just a regular one. Uh, we'll do our home run challenge. Bobby Witt Jr., nice. That's a cool one to get. I have not hit him. And then a uh, rainbow foil. It's going to be Carlos Rodon. Almost a Met uh, again. So lots of Mets, lots of almost Mets. Nice home run challenge. I'll just stick it down on the, on the ground so we see. So we have three regular packs left and then our silver packs. And those can be very exciting. I've seen some nice hits coming out of there. I saw, if you guys haven't checked out uh, Ian's cards, he hit a very, very nice Hall of Fame red autograph out of the silver pack for me. One of these boxes, number to five. So if you guys haven't checked that out, definitely recommend it. Super sweet box. So we'll go ahead and check out what we got in here. So we've got a green ice and our uh, game used relic is going to be in here. So we'll start on the back as usual. Anthony Rizzo. All aces, Joe Musgrove. Let's see what he's covering. A rainbow foil. It's going to be uh, Gavin Lux. Then we've got a green. We'll do that first before the relic. For fun. Oh, look at that one. J-Rod with the cup. That is a nice one. I didn't pull many uh, base rookie parallels out of update, but to hit his, his cup card in a green is beautiful. That is a keeper. That might be a grader, honestly. That's going to be a nice card. Um, and then our major league material is going to be a relic. It's in, uh, brave. It's going to be Ozzy Albizu. It's a bat card. Like most of these are going to be jerseys, so pretty cool to hit a bat. We will, of course, take it. Stick him over by the Henderson without knocking it over, hopefully. Actually, there's plenty of room on the stage. Let me use the center. Get Lou Bob back in the mix. Actually, back in the mix. There we go. Much better. Let's spread things out. All right, and then we gotta sleeve up that J Rod. Come on, it's a beautiful card. So this box is turning out to be uh, quite good. I'm very happy with this. Again, I was I've been saying it since the third pack. This box is fantastic. I'm really dropping the ball here on this Julio. So I like to top load stuff before I put it on the stand, but didn't want to take too much time. Uh, two packs left here. Out of hits, but again, could hit a nice low numbered parallel. You never know. So take our base from the back. Shoot, I think I missed it. 
There we go. The gold foil in here, I don't think there's going to be much besides that. So we'll just run through this. Back 88 is Manny Machado. Got a one-two punch of Scherzer and Verlander, new uh, Mets one-two punch. And gold foil is going to be Derek Hall, rookie. So that's not too bad. I uh, liked watching him on the Phillies. He had some pretty long homers. I was a big fan of that. So we'll stick him down here with the Duran. And last pack for our silvers. See if we can do some damage in a nice, uh, I don't know, vintage stock. Is that greeting? No, we do have another gold, so tons of another ad way to start off that back part of the base. And we have a rookie on the 88. I haven't hit any rookies yet. Vinny Pascantino, we'll take that. Stick him down there. We got a one-two punch of McClanahan and Boz. Take from the front. We got a gold and a gold foil to end our regular main box. We'll start with a gold foil. We get a Josh Naylor. Always recognize him. Then our gold. Dylan Cease, nice. I like Dylan Cease a lot. I follow him on everything. He's a big disc golfer, and I'm pretty into disc golf. So if you guys have a chance to check him out on uh, YouTube or anyone else's disc golf videos that feature Dylan Cease, definitely check it out. He's pretty dang solid. I mean, if you're a decent athlete, you can probably do okay in disc golf, and he's you know definitely a, a, a fan of it. So he's taking some time to get pretty good. So that's our main box, and we'll get into these silver packs. It's 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 really tough to tell on these. I have no idea. They seem a little tougher to hit in than in update, but it's definitely still possible. So we'll see what we can do here. It doesn't look like anything in this pack. We've got Nolan Ryan. Still hope for some rookies. Max Meyer. There we go. It's a rookie. Nelson Velasquez and Carlos Correa. So two rookies out of there. We'll take it. See if we can get a nice parallel out of this last pack. They felt about the same to me, so can't imagine we'll have anything. Yeah, nothing in here. That's all right. Chipper Jones, Rafi Devers. Here's another J-Rod. And Leo Piguero to end it. That might be my first Piguero rookie. So really cool there. Wow, what a box. Very, very nice. Um, I think I'll go ahead and leave some of this stuff on the... On this, I'll just pick up the stand stuff. I feel like that's what people are going to like the most. Man, what a break. What a break. Love it. So we got that stuff that's on the uh, on the desk there you can see, but stand stuff. We got a Key Brian Gold to 2023 that we started out with. Got a an Eric Fetty Orange to 299 Buxton print run to 600 Blue 88. Pretty cool. Had a gold manufactured relic of Lou Bob to 75 from Major League Material. It's Ozzy Albee's bat card. Our autograph is pretty solid. Rookie auto of Oswald Peraza for the Yankees. And some of our bigger parallels, we had a J-Rod green foil, number to 499. Really cool card, cup card. Uh, probably the best one was a Gunnar Henderson gold to 2023. Pretty nice one, 1098. And uh, Nolan Gorman rainbow foil. So guys, Awesome box. Big fan of Series 1. Like I said, I'll have some more jumbos coming very soon. But let me know what you think. Let me know if you had a favorite card. And uh, thank you guys for watching. See ya.